hey guys welcome back in this video we are going to see how to delete the category data in laravel 8 so as we had seen in the previous video we have edited and updated the details now we are going to make the delete button how it is going to work so we'll refresh and here when you click on edit you are getting this edit page right so when we click on delete we need to delete this category so let's get started with the coding part so first we'll create a route say route get and here say delete category you can use the delete method also to delete I am using the get method so here just pass the ID comma and within the square brackets call your controller name category controller class and give the method name just try copy that and add a semicolon over here go to the category controller and create a function and here we are passing the id okay let me just add the public keyword over here public function destroy the id which we are going to send so that id from where we are going to send i'll show you so in this category controller itself the index function we are returning the index page so we'll go there and here as we had done for the edit thing we are going to do the same thing for the delete button so you're going to say a tag and the href here within double curly braces yeah call the url function and what the url you had given over here the same url just copy it and paste it over here slash and followed by a dot dollar item of id so we are concatenating the id so when you click on this whichever row you are clicking that id will go and we have to delete that id in the controller so here we have got the id over here so let us first filter the data say dollar category equal to category model and find dollar id semicolon and now we are, we are going to do is first we will check if this particular category has an image or not so first i'll check if dollar category of image so if there is an image it will come inside this here we are going to check if first we need to declare the path right so let's say dollar path and here we are going to say the path of the image where we are storing so we are storing it inside assets slash uploads slash category slash the category of image name copy and with the using a dot just concatenate it with semicolon and here we are going to say if file exists and just pass the path in this so if there is any file in this path with this name it will come inside this if function and we are if condition and here we are going to delete it okay function delete dollar path save okay so so this will just delete the path i mean the delete the file from this public folder assets images i mean assets uploads inside the category right it is just going to delete the image from there so to delete the record from the database we have to just give this thing category of delete okay semicolon save and here we are going to return and redirect to the category page category along with a message say width and status comma just pass the message here say category deleted successfully save and let us test the code now so go and refresh and we are going to delete this mobile phone so here so id number seven so we'll just click on delete and it says 404 not found let us check why 
okay we have redirected to category and we have it as categories i'll just copy that and paste it over here so that means it has deleted and while redirecting it was just saying for not for not found so let me just paste it over here and check yeah so you can see that data is deleted so if you delete this thing again it's going to just delete and redirect but we have not got the success message here right so similarly for the insert update and all we have given this status but we have not got this message so in the next video i will show you how to show this success message using sweet alert in laravel 8 so that's it in this video guys we have seen how to delete the data along with the image in laravel 8 so thank you for watching this video please like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you once again